This is a bottle of wine. When you pop the cork on your favorite bottle, you are enjoying more than a bunch of fermented grapes. In reality, you are tasting the results of a combined effort of hundreds of people all over our region. People who grow, analyze, build, design, manufacture, package, transport, serve, and host. Let's go beyond the bottle and see how this world-famous product came to be. Believe it or not, grapes weren't always grown in the Willamette Valley, but ever since the first vines were planted in the early 1960s, a beautifully intricate industry has sprouted and reached well beyond our borders. On any given vineyard, it takes a team of botanists, farmhands, and managers to guarantee grapes grow healthy and ready to harvest. In many cases, wine is made right here where the grapes are grown by the same hands that planted it. Once ready, hundreds of varieties, mixes, brands, and vintages are bottled here, here, and here. They are labeled with designs created by graphic artists who live here. The wine is shipped to wine shops, grocery stores, and restaurants all over the world to be enjoyed by people here, here, and here. Back home, wine is also packaged and sent to bottle shops, grocery stores, and restaurants to be enjoyed over a nice dinner or relaxing midsummer sunset. Bottles are also open, served, and explained by the makers themselves at local tasting rooms, many of which are beautifully built by local craftspeople on the vineyard, with lumber grown and harvested here. Visitors come from all over the world to experience the unique terroir of Willamette Valley wines on our home turf, staying at hotels, inns, and resorts located here, here, and here. So when you pour a glass of your favorite wine, take a moment to appreciate the hard work, continual research and development, new innovations, generational wisdom, custom machinery, and all of the designers, barrel makers, bottlers, truck drivers, chefs, and sommeliers who make that pour possible and make our region, bottle by bottle, the best place to be.